What a truly amazing day to be out in the forest. Everything is so lush, so green. Especially in those damp areas. Up here around Burnstick Lake, there's plenty of those. They're kind of boggy. The water in them is clean but stained brown from all the tannins in the soil. But of course there's plenty of life around them. Pines, willows, and especially larches or tamaracks really love those boggy spots. The central Alberta forest grows right up to the edge of them. Ducks and other water birds love them. And the butterflies love the dandelions that grow there too. The forest is just starting to bloom right now and things like arnica are popping up everywhere. Bluebells too. They're so pretty, these little things. I had fun crawling around in the grass taking pictures of them. The arnica were the ones that really stood out, nice and bright and yellow. But I saw something else too. This is a male ruffed grouse. And he was getting ready to make some noise, but he didn't seem to want to do it while I was sitting there. So I went and photographed the wild roses that are just starting to bloom too. Man, the bugs do love these flowers. I guess they're a pretty good place for making other bugs. But then I went back to look for the grouse. This time, he ignored me. I love that sound. You feel it almost more than you hear it. But man, what a cool sound. And what a cool place. I love coming up here at this time of year when the pond lilies are spreading their big green leaves. And I can fly my little drone over top and have a look at where they're growing. I'm always amazed that they're here, but not very much farther south. Don't know why that is. And then there's Burnstick Lake itself. It is a lovely place and full of pike and perch and walleye. I don't have a boat of any kind, so I've never fished it, but I'm sure it's great. And it's fun just exploring along the shore. Water striders, little wild strawberry blossoms. This is the exoskeleton of a dragonfly nymph. Here's a goose feather in the late daylight along the shore. And of course, the lilies. I love looking at them both from above the water and below. Although, I did get one foot kind of wet shooting this. But more than anything, I love the springtime music the forest plays. Especially the drum solo. <laughs> 